The Life of Charles Darwin Among the great naturalists of the 19th century, the late Charles Darwin was a renowned theorist and author. His theories and ideas helped shape our understanding of how species evolve and the evolution of our planet. Throughout his career, he made a wide range of contributions to the study of evolution and natural selection. His theory of the origin of species and his writings on evolution were a massive success, gaining wide popularity. Born in Shropshire, England, in 1809, Charles Darwin was the son of a well-to-do surgeon and a doctor. When he was 16, he enrolled in Edinburgh University in Scotland. He later claimed he learned little at the institution. During his time there, he studied botany, geology, and medicine. After his time at Edinburgh, Darwin returned to England. He stayed in London for six years and worked in scientific circles. He then moved to the quaint village of Down, Kent. His uncle Josiah Wedgwood founded a famous pottery works in the area and became an icon of anti-slavery movements. In Down, Kent, Darwin lived with his first cousin Emma Wedgwood. Darwin's father was a physician. His family had strong anti-slavery beliefs. He grew up in a family of doctors, and he admired his grandfather for his knowledge of medicine. However, he was more interested in the study of natural history than medicine. He was also exposed to important philosophical works, including those of German Romanticism and the philosopher Alexander von Humboldt. During his time in South America, Darwin gathered large bones of extinct mammals. He also catalogued thousands of carcasses and skins. He also spotted bands of oyster shells running through rocks on the Cape Verde Islands. He also observed the impact of slavery in South America. Darwin returned to England in 1836. He was offered a position as a naturalist aboard the HMS Beagle. The Beagle sailed around the world, visiting various locations in Africa, Australia, and South America. He was assigned to prepare accurate charts for these areas. He also had frequent trips to the Bahia Blanca and Port St. Julian. His most influential book, On the Origin of Species, was published in 1859. Darwin's interest in animals led him to question how species developed over time. He began to draft a multi-volume work called Natural Selection. While he continued to write books on plants, he also published a series of books on the behavior of insects and earthworms. He also published his magisterial three-volume work on barnacle classification. The Beagle Voyage had an influence on his entire approach to the study of evolution. It inspired him to see the power of gradual, continuous change and helped him understand the nature of natural selection. In the course of his travels, Darwin had many experiences that shaped his views on evolution. If you want to play a game on Darwin, click in the link below. The game is an interactive multiple choice questions quiz. Hit the like button and subscribe to our channel.